Hello and welcome to my first ever trip report. I flew from Amsterdam to Prague via Warsaw with Polish Airlines lot, but more on that a little bit later. After a bit of a bumpy start to my day due to some rail maintenance I didn't know about, I eventually found my way to Amsterdam Schiphol Airport and was the first person to check in. Big props to the staff who checked me in early even though I was prepared to wait and 20 minutes until check-in commenced. So that was probably one of the more pleasant uh, security experiences I've had. They were very curious by what I do for work and you know why I'm flying so many different places because I, I was honest with them and I told them um, my weird itinerary. Polish Airlines lot is part of the Star Alliance and with no status and only an economy seat ticket, I headed straight to the gate to check out the Embraer 190 taking me to Warsaw. From what I saw, there are two, sorry, there are four business class seats at the front of the cabin in the 2-2 configuration throughout the plane. Business seats have a seat blocked off next to them, a premium meal, extra baggage, lounge access, and a few other perks. But apart from that, it was kind of virtually the same. As the flight was running at less than 60% capacity, I made my way to my seat down the back of the plane and found no neighbor. I guess I flew business class just uh, without the meal. With a 7 p.m. departure time, both the takeoff and landing were in the dark. When booking my ticket, it said economy customers would be given a snack and a drink. It turned out to be a chocolate bar and the choice of water or juice. All other food was extra. As it was dinner time, I bought a really delicious ham sandwich. The only other thing to know is that there is no in-flight entertainment on these Embraer flights. So I've just checked into the Renaissance Hotel in uh, Warsaw at the airport and check out this hotel. I've even checked out the bathroom. Oh look at this! It looks like that um, well what's the famous painting? So g'day from Warsaw. 
I didn't expect to find myself in Poland on this trip, but that's exactly where I am. I found a really good flight deal flying Polish Airlines lot between Amsterdam and Prague if I overnighted in Warsaw. I know that there are direct flights between Amsterdam and Prague. I think they're with EasyJet and Czech Airlines, Czech Airways, but uh, Czech Airways wanted me to fly at 9.30 in the morning and I've already flown EasyJet, so it was time to fly someone new. I've got my ticket, my bag's already checked on through, so let's go to the airport. You've got to love a bus boarding because it meant that I could get right up close with the Embraer 195, taking me from Warsaw to Prague. So the only real discernible difference between the 190 and 195 is that the 195 is just a little bit longer and can take more people. This does mean that the range is slightly less, but you'll still find them perfect for hopping all around Europe. So emergency exit on these Embraers have to be some of the more generous emergency exit seats I've ever sat in. There is just so much room for activities. If you know where that is from, please comment below. I'm really curious to see who else is a big movie buff like me. But onto the literature pocket, there's a sick bag, the safety card, And the Kaleidoscope magazine, which was actually a really good read. I read it on the first uh, on the first flight of the two, and um, some really good stuff in there. And of course, duty free shopping. So the menu for the in flight is inside the Kaleidoscope magazine. There's plenty of things to choose from, whether it's breakfast, lunch or dinner that you're looking for. If you've got a sweet tooth, they've got some confectionery. There's also plenty of drinks, whether it's water or juices or perhaps a little alcoholic beverage that will tickle your fancy. Just like the first flight, we were served a complimentary Prince Polo bar and a choice of drinks, water, juice and soft drink. And I also grabbed some Haribo to sate my sweet tooth. With no in-flight entertainment, I chose to just watch out the window and soak up some of that sun before we descended into Prague. Now just for a quick bathroom tour. It was a fairly standard bathroom in the Embraer 195. One thing I did like is this odour eliminator. I haven't seen that on an aircraft before, but such a great idea. But apart from that, everything was fairly standard.
for those tall people, uh, the bathroom's a little bit vertically challenged, I believe is the word that I will use. Um, just watch out for your head. So just a really quick summary of my two flights with Polish Airlines lot. I'm really surprised that they were only running at 50 to 60% capacity. Perhaps it's because people aren't traveling to Prague at this time of year or traveling to Poland. But overall, I found their aircraft to be really comfortable, their crew to be really friendly, and overall, it just being a nice experience. I would be keen to fly one of their larger um, aircraft on a long haul flight because I've heard, again, mixed opinions about this. But for the Embraer's 190 and 195, I'd say do it. It was a great flight.